verify the loss of transverse vibration in stretched string using sonometer. Materials required are sonometer, tuning forks of different frequencies, weight hanger with weights, rubber hammer and steel wire. Sonometer consists of a hollow rectangular wooden box with holes for free vibration. A meter scale is fixed at two sides of the wooden box. One meter length of string is fixed to one end and passes through two movable bridges B1 and B2. A frictionless pulley is fixed at the edge of the box. The weights are hanged at the other end of the string. Here, a paper rider is placed at the midpoint of vibrating segment. First layer. Now suspend a 2000 grams weight to the weight hangers. So tension is applied to the wire. Now keep a paper writer at the middle of the bridges. Now beat the tuning fork of known frequency with rubber hammer. Now press the shank on the sonometer box between the bridges B1 and B2. Here we observe the paper rider is not fall down. Now adjust the distance by moving the B1 bridge. Now beat the tuning fork again and press it on sonometer. Now note the length of the string between the bridges as L1. Here we get L2 is equal to 10.7 cm. Okay student, after watching the videos, here we have already arranged the apparatus and now we are going to take set of reading, we are going to perform this experiment. So Minimis and Santosh sir is going to help you to see how to perform this experiment and take the readings. Okay, so here we go. Okay, we have set the apparatus, this is the sonometer and you can see the sonometer which is a wooden box and uh, metallic wire is connected over here, the pulley. It is hanged, weight is hanged over here and from the weight hanger, that is weight hanger is 500 gram, then again 4 more weight we have added, milk 2500 grams we have added here, so this is the tension load we are applied at the end of the wire. Now, balancing length means the length between the two knife edges, these are the knife edges. So we know that 
the we need proper contact that is why so the knife head should get properly connect, um, contacted with the metallic wire okay so this is a, this is the length length between that we have applied at the end of the wire through the pulley uh, then m is the linear density it is not the one so according to the law we know that for the highest frequency the length will be the minimum so i am adjusting the length from 10 cm onwards so by using a meter scale we adjust the length between the two knife edges as 10 cm Now we will keep a paper rider in the middle of the uh, length what we have taken. We will keep like this. So this is the rubber pad. This uh, 24 will be strengthened on the rubber pad like this. Then we have to touch the handle of the 24 to the wooden board you can hear the sound so what we have to do is adjust the length in such a way that the there will be a resonance happens between the natural frequency of the 24 and the uh, frequency of the vibrating wire hmm. when the resonance occurs paper rider on the uh, wire will fly off we have to take that ready Done. Okay. So we'll see how much is the reading for Where this line. Just a second, please. Aha. So as you can see, student, reading is coming 16.1. So we'll write 16.1. Between the two nitrogen, that is the balancing length. Here you got uh, 15, 16. You got 16. One reading, you got 16. You can see the paper rider is moving. See it's flying off. So the hanger we have taken it is 500 grams. We will write like this mass of the hanger. Hmm. Total mass means mass of the hanger plus mass added. So it will be mass of the hanger plus mass added. That is 500 plus 2000 grams we are adding so together it is 2500 grams okay tension is mass multiplied with the uh, g that is m multiplied with 980 done now the frequency for the first one we have taken 512 the higher frequency one so you got one balancing length as 16 meter you wrote like The first reading we got 16 centimeter. Now the second reading we got 16.1 centimeter. Now the mean of 16 and 16.1 we we know how to find out the mean. Add it and divide it by two because there are two readings. So you'll get 16 plus 16.1 divided by two. You'll get 16.05. That is the first reading. Now we'll take second tuning fork which is having a frequency 480 hertz. Miss. Okay, so now Miss is going to take frequency of 480 hertz and we will show you how to get desired length from this frequency. So Miss, please continue. So this is the length we have selected. Now frequency is gone less. It means length we have to increase little bit more as compared to the previous reading. So when Mrs. is hammering, see you will see little bit vibration will start happening. Okay. Yes, yeah, started happening. So to hold and hammer, yes. Now when paper falls, now we have to take reading. So we will find out the length of the wire which is coming here 18.3 18.3 or 2 2 na 18.2 okay okay 
second 24 we have taken is 480 so according to the law frequency 1 512 so the balance length what we got is 16 centimeter so we got uh, we wrote here as 16 centimeter in the place of l1 now we will take one more reading so in order to minimize the error we will take two readings then we will find out the mean